Well, you know, it's it's really exciting for me to be in Connecticut. Uh, it is it is such a great community, and of course, it's got such tremendous academic institutions, global brands uh, that uh, that are world renowned. So it was, it's really exciting to be here. Um, having spent the time here today, it gives me a lot of hope and enthusiasm. This community really is coming together around a strong commitment to building a great startup ecosystem here in Connecticut. And uh, you know, I think it really translated into the fact that the people are here, they're willing to commit, uh, they're, working, they're willing to work together. And, and those notions are very, very important as we've seen elsewhere in what it takes to build a great startup community. Well, we, we in, in the work that we do in, in Waterloo, Ontario, of course, we focus on, on, a, on a principle that is no company left behind. And, and, and really why we do that is because when we're working with really early stage companies, it's important to give each of them the opportunity and the time necessary to either fail or be successful. And it's also very, very, very difficult, especially for the very early stage companies, to be able to know which companies are going to be successful and which ones are not. And so I think it's very important that there is that kind of commitment to ensuring that you know everyone that walks through the door is going to have an opportunity to be able to engage, to use the resources, to benefit from the programs and services, to be able to work through those important um, processes to determine whether or not their company is going to make it or break it. I think Connecticut's great strengths are in the fact that it's got, uh, you know, a remarkable place to live. It's beautiful, great, uh, great communities, great cities, great towns. Um, it's a fantastic place that people really want to live. I think the second thing, of course, is it's got these world-renowned academic institutions, institutions like University of Connecticut and, of course, Yale. Um, these are huge anchors and engines for the economy that, you know, translate in bringing some of the smartest people from around the world to your community. So you've got tremendous assets. Now, of course, you've got this community that's come together and said, you know what, we want to rally around the, these assets that we have. We want to translate some of this into building some great startups and some great mid and large size companies. So, you know, there really is a tremendous amount that is going for this state. Now, of course, what we're seeing in addition to that, and I think one of the most exciting recent announcements, is the leadership of, of the government here in the state of Connecticut. You know, real commitments to science, technology, engineering, and math. Real commitments to back the entrepreneur. Real, real commitments to say, we're going to help to bridge some of those gaps and barriers that get in the way of people starting and growing great technology companies. With the three of those combined, I really think that Connecticut has got a huge opportunity ahead of them.